students we are talking about chemical kinetics one of the most important chapter from board perspective as well as competitive point of view and in that today we will be talking about zero order reaction so as you know chemical kinetics is one of the easiest chapter but the issue is the solution of any numerical is pretty long correct so let us see few shortcuts by which we can solve zero order reaction questions in very less time okay so as you already know t50% of zero order reaction is equal to a0 by 2k that means if i draw a graph between t half and a0 then it will be a straight line passing through origin with a slope of 1 by 2k correct now as you already know the t50% from here can be written as directly proportional to the initial concentration that means a0 1 by a0 2 will be equal to t half 1 by t half 2 in two different conditions correct that means if i change the initial concentration t half value will also change correct now what else i have to study next is disintegration so for zero order reaction there is a very simple rule for disintegration if we have equal amount of drop then the intervals will also be equal okay now how to understand this okay let us say that i am having 100 as the value of a particular reactant and then it is dropped to 80 then what is the drop there 20 let us say that for this 20 drop i require t time interval okay then if it drops from 80 to 60 then again the time interval required will be t then from 60 to 40 again t 40 to 20 again t and then 20 to 0 again t remember zero order reaction is considered to be completed by 100% okay now let us understand this well with the help of a question let us say that i am having a reactant in 0.5 molar and in 10 minutes it is converted into 0.4 molar now the question is what is the t half value okay now let us see that the drop in the concentration is 0.1 molar correct so from 0.5 to 0.4 the drop is how much 10 minutes right so 0.4 to 0.3 again the drop will be 10 minutes 0.3 to 0.2 again it will be 10 minutes 0.2 to 0.1 again 10 minutes and 0.1 to 0.0 that means completion of the reaction will again take place 10 minutes that means from 0.5 to 0 the concentration will be degraded in 50 minutes correct so t 100% is equal to 50 correct now what is the relation between t 100% and t half t 100% of zero order reaction is equal to 2 t half correct so the t half will be 50 by 2 that means 25 minutes easy correct to make your concept stronger and stay ahead in your learning journey join me and other subject matter experts on tutorito app for daily free concept classes download the app right now